it, it was a, a great experience, I think, for, for the players to play at that level. We had many new players. Um, we tried to play a different way, which I think we were quite successful in. I think we did very well against the Philippines in the first game. Um, last five minutes, maybe mismanaged the last five minutes. Lack of game experience, lack of maybe some leadership in certain areas. Um, and game two, we completely dominated. Uh, hopefully you saw the game and you would see that, you know, it was about 25 corners to zero. They got in our half twice in the second half. So we completely dominated, but we missed that cutting edge in the, in the, in the final third. Um, but hopefully we learn from that, you know. In these international games, you have to take your chances and make the most of the opportunities when you're winning. Vatsalya Natural IVF Adunik Chikitsa Uccha Safalta Dar Antarashtriya Starko Upachar Dwara Santan Prapti Sambhav Cha Well, have most possession and have those little moments, you have to take advantage of that. We didn't do that, we have to learn from that. Um, I think the Philippines will quite easily defeat Hong Kong, which will leave us second in the group. Um, and we, we hopefully we stay together and go again next opportunity. Girls are outstanding. Their attitude to, to a new way of playing, their attitude to training and trying to learn every day and live in each moment. Um, maybe it's better you ask them, you know, um, but I was very happy with their attitude. Um, and as I say, hopefully it's a great opportunity for them to, to grow and to become better players. And I think most importantly, we tried to set high standards in training and in camps and in team meetings. Hopefully they can take that back into their clubs and raise the standards in their clubs and raise the standard of, of all coaches uh, across Nepal and the women's football grows. Well, the negative is the last five minutes against the Philippines. That was it. That was all it took, you know. So if you Had we gone into the Hong Kong game with a victory against the Philippines, that would have put uh, a lot of fear into Hong Kong and would have given us a lot more confidence. So the negative was the last five minutes against the Philippines. Um, and the positives were everything else. You know, we, we were together for six weeks. We developed a new playing style, um, which other countries commented on. They'd never seen that before. Um, the players themselves have expressed how they're, they're learning a different way and growing. Um, and, um, and believing now that they can compete with the best teams in, in Asia. So. It's a growing experience for us, but it's important that this group stays together and keeps playing games as we lead into um, staff competition next year. I thought we were physically fit, but you need to be match fit. So, and, and to manage things like the last five minutes of international competition, you need to play games to do that. You, you can't do it in training situations. You have to play games. So it's important that, as I said, the group, and hopefully COVID allows us to travel and play more games and keep the group together, but they have to play games. We've seen the preparation of the men's team um, and some progression, so we hope that we get six months um, opportunities to, to, to play games and to travel and learn uh, and get better.